Hi everyone, Tegan Neville here, author of the beautiful Self-Discovery Inspirational Cards. I'm so excited to be here today uh, with you all. I've got, um, yeah, for those that don't know me, um, I have created these beautiful self-discovery inspirational cards and I'm coming on fortnightly to share a card with you each fortnight and looking into a bit more about what the message and the energy and theme behind the card and just working with that over the fortnight. So we do this live video and then also I do a blog post extending on the theme on um, the following Monday and yeah, working with the card each fortnight. So these beautiful cards have come about, um, I experienced postnatal depression and had a bit of a rough time and along my healing journey I discovered my beautiful gift to um, create this intuitive art and I just let my body go and um, using pastels and watercolours and create this intuitive art colors and scripts come out and I feel what the message is and for me all these cards were created along that healing journey so along the way um, there were messages that I needed at that time and um, yeah really kind of taking them on board and releasing um, stuff and getting lighter and lighter so I'm so excited to be able to share these beautiful cards with you and I um, yeah just really want to be able to help and inspire others um, to get rid of that heaviness inside and experience the lightness like I um, was able to with um, inspired by these cards and sharing them in this way so um, yeah that that's what um, we're doing so today <sighs> The card for today let me get myself sorted I just need to breathe a bit I think um, the card is actually quite a happy and bubbly card today so without further ado the card for today is be joyous feel the lightness that comes with the joy of positive thinking so yeah this card, the bright sunshine, um, if you're looking closer at the artwork, you can see lots of these little spirals uh, that are underneath um, that, yeah, there's just lots of movement, lots of joy and really, really about um, inviting in positivity and choosing to let go or not give energy to those more heavier thoughts so today is really about um, yeah accepting and inviting in positivity and I will mention that the card there was another card that wanted to come and help um, with the theme for this video in particular so I will keep working on this card during this fortnight but um, friends love and accept all that you are so this card um, about love and accept all that you are so I feel like today's uh, yeah about this positive thinking and feeling the lightness that comes with the joy of positive thinking let's work on it in relation to how we perceive ourselves and how we accept and feel about ourselves so let's bring in positivity specifically into that area and um yeah if anyone is um oh some people have said hi <laughs> hi Rosalyn and hi Casey welcome so um yeah please if you are joining us please do comment so um yeah I can say hi to you so I'll just read um, the self-discovery inspirational cards. So they come with this super cool um, display because I really felt it important to be able to display a card for your day, your week, your month, whatever it will be, um, just so you can kind of yeah be it be there as a reminder and reflect on it. And um, there's also a guidebook as well and. 
the guidebook, um, I've just written like little bits. I didn't want to write too much extra. So just if you need a little bit more on it, um, I've yeah put that in the guidebook. But I really encourage people who use these cards to sit with the card itself and just see what comes up for you because it's really about connecting back in with you and discovering that amazing person that you are. So um I will read today for Be Joyous. So as is on the card, feel the lightness that comes with the joy of positive thinking. And then the extra bit is make the conscious decision to fill yourself with positivity. No longer dwell on the negative, allowing the heaviness of those emotions and thoughts weigh you down. Share your joy with others. So very simple, short and sweet message with this one. And again, it's about making that decision to invite the positivity and fill yourself up with the positive feelings rather than sitting with those heavy ones. So um, to kind of give a bit, when I was trying to heal from um, the depression, I had just so much yinness inside, a lot of years of um, that negative self-talk happening because I had quite low self-esteem. And so, you know, my shoulders would be hunched. I had no energy, like, yeah, the fatigue was quite prominent. Um, felt just very heavy everywhere. And I, even for one week, I went on a wellness retreat um, and they were, they were encouraging, like, I just started paying attention to those um, negative self-talk and the way that I talked about myself, both out loud, but also in my head. And someone just brought, yeah, the attention to that. And um, they actually suggested a kind of tool that I could use is when I notice myself saying something about myself that is not very nice or, you know, it's not positive, um, to in my head go cancel, clear, delete. I was very, um, used to do a lot with computers. So <laughs> the cancel, clear, delete button, um, yeah, that, that worked for me, but something else might like imagining that written on a piece of paper and tearing it up or what, whatever works for you. But whenever I, I just really started paying attention to the thoughts that I was having and I would do the cancel, clear, delete and then replace it with something um, that was positive. And even if I didn't really believe it at the time or feel like I believed it, I made the conscious decision to replace those um, heavier thoughts. So I don't know, one example, I was walking in the bush and um, at the time, yeah, because mine was um, very connected to postnatal, so a lot of motherhood stuff and, um, you know, things like uh, I'm a really bad mom or I'm not doing right by my kids. Um, you know, guilty thoughts, whatever. So I would do my cancel, clear, delete, and I'd just say, wow, I'm an awesome mum. Wow, I'm doing great. And just I noticed even after a week of doing this, I distinctly remember getting up off um, the couch in this living area at the wellness place, and all of a sudden I'm like, whoa, I'm, I'm feel like I'm standing taller and standing straighter and I just need to go to the toilet or something but just I noticed just getting up and really feeling that and noticing the difference it was making so even within a week of actively replacing these thoughts I felt the difference so um yeah that was um yeah, really lovely. And so I've just noticed, um, I, I always have trouble keeping up with comments, so I do apologise in advance. Um, but Casey, you've said, is this card for everyone? So yes, so what I do with these um, Connecting Within videos, I actually just choose um, a main card each 
fortnight to yeah look into for everyone so it's i have the intention of you know what theme what is going to help people that view this video and when i pick the card and so yes definitely this is for everyone and it might not necessarily resonate in the exact same way for each person um, but I really feel that everyone that's drawn to the video there is something here that you can work with and again that's about connecting within to yourself and feeling um, yeah what it is that um, your inner voice is trying to help you with I really 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 believe that our inner selves they want to heal they want to be our best selves so um, just yeah listening to that inner voice and sometimes I do in the videos if it's relevant I do sometimes um, draw a card for some people in relation to this so um, but I usually just see where the video takes me and where the universe yeah wants it to go today so we shall see <laughs> so yeah, with that around, so I'm really feeling like um, this morning is really about paying attention to that negative self-talk that we might have and um, choosing to bring in the positive. And so um, I think that we might actually do a... Okay, hold on. Before I go, we might do a little bit of a mindfulness, but before we do that, I will actually um, draw a card for anyone that would like to, to help maybe pinpoint certain areas around this. So please, in the comments, if you would like, um, yeah, me to draw a card um, to help for the, it might be to help for the mindfulness part that's coming up. Um, yeah, please comment. Um, just yes or yes please or whatever you would like um, in the comments so but I will um, be also yeah kind of bring up that um, we're also looking at it in relation to loving and accepting all that we are so please keep that in mind for this morning that the positive thoughts that we're trying to bring in it's really about um, how we feel about ourselves and even if at the moment we don't quite feel really good about ourselves to just replace those thoughts anyway and see what happens so after actively doing that for a week hopefully some of yeah that patterning that we've put in say like whether it's years of low self-esteem and lots of negative self-talk or maybe it's just something that's been happening lately that went wrong and you've been berating yourself a little bit um, just see what happens when you replace with positive thoughts so okay so Christine you would like oh from New Zealand hi I'm in Australia <laughs> um would love a cut okay so Christine hello and let's have a look at which area of positivity around that idea of accepting yourself okay so you've got opposites so opposites um, around within are fighting forces oh I'm feeling very very shaky right now and feeling yeah very upset I feel a bit around like um, lots of fighting between what you should or think you should be who you think you should be and um, as well as um, who you really are so I just need to take a breath to calm these really really bad nerves down okay so for you Christine when we do the mindfulness I'm going to mention that we want to sit in our heart center when I say that for you, I would really like you to sit in your power center. Um, yeah, and work work from your power center. Um, so yeah, I'm around. So this um, accepting yourself. So I will say the universe feels like wanting to, um, you to pay more attention to how you feel 
about yourself in relation. Okay, so it feels like taking too much on from others and just really sitting from yourself and allow your power and your inner self to shine through. So, um, yeah, I'd like you to sit with that in relation to this positive, being joyous, bringing in positivity around yourself. Okay, so I hope that will help. Um, oh, wow, Casey, you're from New Zealand as well. Oh, yes, the, all the things that are happening in Christchurch. I send love and light to you all. Wow. Okay, so um, let me have a look. So, Casey, you would like a card as well. <sighs> I just love this card. I love the positive and the bubbliness. Okay. So wonderful Casey. Again, around accepting and loving all that you are. So trust within. Allow your inner self to communicate. So I'm feeling like this really big squish down, whether it's like a whole heap of these giant heavy books squishing down your true thoughts, your um, trust and your yeah, it's just like you're pushing it, pushing it um, down. So there's also like um, the jackhammer, even though that's kind of opening up. But yeah, that really, it's a really aggressive um, pushing it down, blocking it out of the way and not a, allowing them to come, come through. So that's, um, yeah, something around this for today with trusting within. So trusting yourself, um, yeah, and... Yep, okay, I will leave it there. <laughs> okay, and Rosalind, you would like one as well. Okay. All right. So for Rosalind, okay. So self-discovery, so a period of self-discovery is either happening now or encourage, I feel like it's maybe happening now already. And so the discovery of who you truly are is a gift. So the who you truly are being a gift that is something when we do this mindfulness in a moment to um, really keep in mind, Rosalind. So um, who you truly are is a gift and to sit with that and allow that message to seep throughout your whole body. Okay. Okay. So. Yeah, always going a bit of a different direction. I didn't expect to do that today. So now <laughs> let's um, bring it back in and do a bit of mindfulness. Um, so when I say mindfulness, I just mean we'll do a little brief meditation and really to bring in those positive energies. And, um, yeah, so if you feel comfortable Please get into a comfy position, lightly close your eyes and it's great if you can feel your feet planted on the floor, otherwise any comfy position for you. And with your eyes lightly closed or just slightly open, just start to take some nice deep breaths in and out. As you breathe in, feel your breath flowing down your spine. Feel your belly expand and contract as the breath flows all the way down and all the way up and out. Make your next breath as big as you can, filling yourself up with beautiful light, positivity, oxygen and exhale out your mouth and just let go and settle into your body. 
Continue deeply breathing, breathing in light and positivity and breathing out, letting go. Feel your feet planted on the floor, feel your buttocks supporting you, feel the uprightness of your spine. And now as you breathe in and out, bring your attention to your heart centre. Breathe light into your heart centre. Really feeling positive, happy, bubbly energy being brought in to your heart centre. And if you feel any heaviness or darkness, anything that you feel doesn't belong in a beautiful, happy, positive space, when you breathe out, just let it go and maybe send some extra light into this space. And don't worry if you do feel any heaviness here or any darkness. Be okay with that, but have the intention to bring in light and love into this area. And as you sit in this area, hold the intention that you love and accept all that you are. Hold the intention that you are going to bring positivity and joy and feel the lightness all throughout your body in the coming week. As you sit here in the joy and positivity, it might be yellow like the card or joy and positiveness might have a different colour for you. Imagine your whole being being filled with this beautiful energy. Let it expand from your heart centre out, filling every little bit of your being and even out further so that you can radiate this positive, warm, beautiful energy. And while you're doing this, filling yourself with this beautiful energy, this beautiful positivity, you might like to bring to mind any of the areas that were just brought up previously with the cards and just allow that message to be filled throughout yourself to really hold and connect. Take one last deep breath in all the way into your belly, feeling it expand filling yourself with this beautiful light and exhale slowly coming back into the space that you're in wiggling your toes and your fingers feeling yourself maybe sitting a bit more upright hopefully feeling lighter and maybe smiling and if you're not smiling give it a try anyway <laughs> let yourself just be enjoy sitting in the space that you're in. <sighs> Thank you so much for joining me in that. I was intending to send beautiful light and positivity energy to you, so I hope you felt it. And it's lovely to give yourself this gift of just taking the time to sit and to bring in that beautiful positivity. So um, that is our session for today around bringing, feeling the lightness that comes with the joy of positivity in relation to how we feel about ourselves. So I'd love to know if, um, yeah, how 
the uh, meditation felt for you if you think it helped um open to suggestions also so this is i think maybe only my third one of these videos so very open to what you think might be helpful and um, just a reminder that if you would like to purchase the um, self-discovery inspirational cards you can do so on the white light publishing house i have put the link in at the very beginning and um, the other thing that uh, i will do also is to give um put a link to my facebook page it's up from spirit if you're interested on there um to yeah see a bit more about me and um also if you're interested in some intuitive guidance of a positive and inspiring nature then please let me know i um on my facebook site you'll be able to see a little promo video that i've done around a new service that i'm offering so if you are after some direction or um yeah just you know what you could work on they're just such beautiful sessions where i um use a combination of my intuitive drawing crystals and cards to um communicate the beautiful guidance to you and yeah the, there are things that generally come out like um positive affirmations and just beautiful healing energies i love doing them so if you are interested please let me know so I think that that is all for today. So on the end, oh, you are very welcome. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, so Casey has said that um, that was good. Needed some grounding and love from within. Been doubting myself. The self-doubt. We get so bogged down in stuff. So, um, yeah, just really pay attention to those thoughts and choose to replace them yeah it's just i can't um like emphasize enough how um just wonderful it is to do that and to yeah i i have been through it so i won't go over it again but um this is something that i just felt found very very beneficial so just yeah, really wanting to share it with others. And this type of thing is out there in lots of different ways too. So um, again, if the way that I've described it doesn't really sit with you or don't think it works, um, yeah, hopefully you'll come across something that does, but just around really um, paying attention to those inner thoughts and choosing to replace them with positive ones. Yeah. So with that, I will just finish up. I don't think there's any more um oh casey is asking how much do i charge so um i'm presuming this is about the intuitive guidance session so if you scroll up um i have put a link on my website the um they're in australian dollars so i'm not sure how um it converts but um i offer a 15 minute half an hour and one hour and um they're um Oh, now you're testing me. I think it's $22, $44, and $88. So um, also, though, if you do subscribe to my um, mailing list, then you do get a 10% discount when you do that. So again, all those links, um, if you scroll up in the comments, I've put them in at the beginning. So yeah, if you're interested, let me know. Okay, so... <laughs> um, be joyous. Let's finish with rereading this. Be joyous. Feel the lightness that comes with the joy of positive thinking. Make the conscious decision. Very important today. I keep feeling like it's really important to make that choice. Make the conscious decision to fill yourself with positivity. No longer dwell on the negative, allowing the heaviness of those emotions and thoughts weigh you down. Share your joy with others. So thank you so very, very much to all those joining me and hello and thank you to those viewing this video later. And I really wish you well and all the best in the coming um, weeks of yeah, replacing those negative thoughts with beautiful, positive ones. And also, yeah, a reminder on Monday. So if you do go to my website, um, 
you and join the mailing list, you will get a bit of an extended where we look um, maybe in a different area about um, what this card can be about. So thank you so very, very much. Sending light and love to you all. Thank you.